Hi there, my name is Tina Smetha and happy International Women's Day. I'm founder of Tinsies, a baby essential boutique backed by science to ignite a love of learning through vibrant colours, challenging that pastel pink and blue gender stereotype. So this is me now bringing together my love of applied sciences and my life as a mum of three. But I started out as a physiologist, working with technology in sports and clinical sectors, all very male dominated fields. I'm proud to say that I took a stand and I called out gender equality early in my career. In my 20s, just married, I was working for a clinical technology company. I was made redundant by my male line manager and in no uncertain terms, it was clear that my desire to start a family was the underlying reason. I was stunned given that this was a progressive technology company in Western Europe. But rather than just accepting this and finding that more suitable job, as it was put, I called this out and I took it right to the top of the organisation. The CEO was genuinely shocked that such attitudes still existed and he thanked me for having the strength to call this out. I was given the choice of having my job back and the CEO demanded that my line manager write a letter of apology. However, I rejected this offer of my job back. I have been brought to know my value and my worth something I strive to instill in my own children today. Now, let us imagine for a moment a state that led the way in creating the world's first charter for human rights with freedom of expression, putting an end to issues such as inequality, slavery, intolerance of all people and religions. A state that promoted the equality, dignity and autonomy of women in every class. A state where employment was based on one's skills rather than gender and where fair pay and paid maternity leave was given. A state where women held powerful, high-ranking positions in government and the military, where women had their own businesses, owned land and managed their own assets independently. Well, this all existed two and a half thousand years ago under Cyrus the Great's Persian Empire. As a Zoroastrian with roots originating in Persia, I am proud that this is part of my heritage. If only history had panned out differently. Women today would not need to fight for their freedoms, universal suffrage, or fight to be treated as equals to their male counterparts in business. But fight we must. My top tip. We have a voice, loud and clear. As women, we belong and we must use our voices at every opportunity, calling out gender bias and inequality when it reveals itself. Our actions have an impact. So let yours be felt. I chose to challenge.